What do Americans think is normal but is actually very weird? Your bloody weird toilet cubicles. Next comment. For some reason, their advertising system. Like dude, it's seriously not okay to show me ads of medicine for me to recommend my doctor to prescribe it to me. Next comment. Next comment. Astronomical portion sizes. I went to an IHOP once and the omelette was crazy huge and even the coffee cup was 2x as big as normal. Next comment. Next comment. That liberal means left wing whereas in the rest of the world it means someone who believes in personal liberty and freedom. Next comment. Most Americans don't know credit score is unique to their country, and that their economy encourage people to live in debt, in order to build a credit score, while a lot of other countries population have savings and don't use credit to buy anything else than a house or a car. I do think banks are winning this trade by making huge interest rate, and that it also push people to consume more than they should or could, which is necessary for capitalism. In a way when you consider what you can get or not depending only on your credit score, there is a comparison to make with the infamous social credit score used in China. Next comment. Next comment. Being interested in college sports. I know nowhere else where a school sports team is of national interest. Next comment. Gaps in the toilet stalls. Next comment. Price tags at the grocery that leave tax off. Next comment. Calculating whether or not to go to the hospital based on the likelihood that you'll die. Next comment. Next comment. Next comment. NFL. I've watched the sport before and I can see the attraction but as an Australian that loves rugby league I just can't understand how the fans became accustomed to such a stop slash start game. I like a free flowing game where momentum ebbs and flows in a natural way. Next comment. Next comment. Having poor people that can't afford healthcare vote against having healthcare for the sake of the poor poor billionaires. Next comment. So many. Asterisk tips in restaurants. Asterisk tax not being included in price. Asterisk having to transfer flights in Atlanta or Dallas. Asterisk having to pay for hospital treatment or health insurance. Asterisk electing orangutans. Asterisk credit score having an effect on employment or rental. Asterisk not getting free food and alcohol on flights. Asterisk taking shoes off at airports. Asterisk capitalism being focused on companies, not consumers. Asterisk high fructose corn syrup. Asterisk Arkansas. Asterisk voting on a weekday. Asterisk not traveling abroad. Asterisk edit, taking your country super seriously. Be more like Britain and indulge in some self-loathing. Next comment. Next comment. Customer service employees being forced to be over the top fake nice all the time. In the UK you pretty much get what you get with customer service employees and we're all fine with it. Next comment. Might not not be an American thing, might be a Californian thing. Might even be a non-European thing, but seriously, do you need that water level in your toilet bowls? Us Brits are not used to the cannonball effect when we go about our dark business. Next comment. Cutting the skin off little boys dicks for no reason other than tradition, then acting surprised when someone tells them it's barbaric, then trying to justify it as I think it looks better as though the local cultural norms for the cosmetic appearance of children's dicks was vital enough to warrant surgery. Next comment. Thinking that their country is the best country in the world. Next comment. Pledge of allegiance in schools. Next comment. Their gun obsession. Really don't understand it? Next comment. Electoral collage. Next comment. Next comment. Thinking that voting is enough. And mocking France for their strike culture. Americans, thus, avoid using their power and leverage in their negotiations for a better quality of life. So no general strikes, protests, and halting the country to a grind to get what they want from the government, politicians, corporations, the wealthy, and the elite. Even Nordic countries strike way more often, Denmark 116 days per 1,000 employees, Norway 56, Finland 37, and USA 5 while France 118. If Americans want to improve their society, they'll need to be tougher. Next comment. Next comment. Paying for medical care. Next comment. Medical bankruptcy. Next comment. Enormous cappuccinos. Next comment. Next comment. Believing that the U. S. A is a true democracy and not a plutocracy. Next comment. Calling football soccer. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and like the video if you enjoyed. Good. Good. Good.